The world has been overtaken by zombie butts. You won't find anyone in your room. Oh. I can only mean one thing. Yeah. I am at a LARPing retreat. I'm dead then, aren't I? You moved out right before shit kicked off. I'm at a LARPing retreat. Look, I'm at the every day. <laughs> JK Calloway here, jumping back into season four of Doom Patrol. It's back, and apparently it's going to be in two parts, which is different. But yeah, episode one of season four is called Doom Patrol. Like, I've been waiting for them to do that, because every, every episode's got patrol at the end of it. They're finally pulling the trigger, because the last thing we saw in, the, in season three was... They decided finally to be a superhero team. Kinda. <laughs> I'd love to tell you what's going on with each character, but who fucking knows with this? I know Jane's got troubles with the underground and all of her personalities. It seems like it's down to just like one or two at this point, and she kind of got fooled, so hopefully Kay is still alive. The, you know, who she, you know, the child that she is. And hopefully Jane's still in there. I think she is, but there's a lot to catch up with there. Cyborg had full synthetic surgery, so as, as far as we know, all of his powers are gone. So I don't really know what role he's got to play anymore <laughs> as far as a super team. You know, he's super smart, no doubt, so that could develop into something, but uh, yeah, and everyone else, everyone's got something going on. They always do. Who knows where it's going to go from here? And I don't know if this is the final season. I think it is, but it's going to be in two parts. So let's jump in and see what the hell, because <laughs> it's been one of the silliest, stupidest, awesomest shows. I, I really dug it. Like, this is the direction DC should have taken. You know what I mean? Like, tongue-in-cheek, yes, but, like, still awesome. Awesome moments. Not just, you know, everyone's sad. I'm, I'm Superman, and I'm sad. Well, I'm Batman, and I'm sad. Well, I'm the Joker, and I'm sad. Like, Jesus Christ. The only fun ones so far have been, like, Aquaman and, and Shazam. You know? Like, I haven't watched Black Adam yet, but hopefully that's fun. But that just seems... more sad. <laughs> We'll see. We'll get to it. Me and Draco will watch that one together on Patreon. If you've been keeping up with that, we've been watching all the all the superhero movies, MCU and DCEU, over on Patreon. Doom Patrol! Season 4 premiere. I, yeah, we'll see where we're going. Hopefully Missy from Doctor Who is still here. Um, yeah, but, uh, let's see where we go from here. And hopefully the guy who, whose power is to make everyone have an orgasm is back. Because, I mean, it's the greatest scene ever made. <laughs> I want more of that. It was hilarious. But let's jump back in. Here we go. All right, where are we picking up? <clears throat> the future. Okay. Maybe Cyborg? I was going to say Cyclops. That's clearly wrong. Clover's in. Don't. Infected. Do the right thing, gun. Okay. Oh. Oh. Okay. So he's like built himself back up into Cyclops, essentially? Steampunk style? Okay. Observations of the Doom Patrol by Dr. Harrison, Day 93, the Harrison. Codpiece Mission. It's been three months and my decision to stay continues to pay dividends. Rita has carved out a starring role for herself as team leader because no one wanted the job. Ready positions! <laughs> Believe it or not, she's led this busted Justice League to seven successful missions. Busted Dear Justice League. Dear Rita. Why do you get to pick the code names? 
because they suck. When you spend days researching and plotting missions, until then, you're Robot Man. Dr. Harrison is Crazy Jane. Larry is Negative Man. Vic is Cyborg. Your dog shit McGivens. <laughs> Elastic Woman. Thank you. In between hating Rouge and being okay. disrespected, Rita had the good idea to attach the brain's robot head to the time machine. She also solved the time travel memory loss problem. Strangely enough, with jellyfish. What? I couldn't tell you why it works. Robot Man! He's frozen. Clifosaurus! Clifosaurus? Without his tech, Rita prefers he stay out of harm's way. But Vic is unsatisfied by his new role and yearns to do more. Right. I'm just the IT guy. What do you mean, just the IT guy? You're an integral part of his villainy. The foundation he builds his nefarious successes on. Oh. <laughs> Transform into something to psych him out. But. Probably. Shit, nice one, Bruce! Are you body shaming me? That's the next level evil. <laughs> I won't even go there. I know I only get one phone call, Dr. H, but I think you're right. It should be to my mom. <laughs> is that my fucking arm? As a matter of fact, it is. <laughs> fucking sweetness! We couldn't make your arm exactly like it was, so, um, we decided to make it better. Gave you the sense of touch in one finger. But over time, if things work the way they're supposed to, the nanites will spread. I don't know what to say. <laughs> Thank you. Don't get it, bro. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're gonna have to get over your shit, lady. I haven't felt anything for 40 years. I think the first thing I like to touch is my grandson. Cliff. Not to be a spoil sport, but technically, you are touching that oven mitt. God damn, it's soft. We're on a fucking Florida! Um, Clifford, I know that you are excited, but the time machine is not an Uber. Why do you make it look so... Oh, what's the harm? Yeah, come on, Rita. Don't be so controlled. Be cool for I once. All right, all right, all right. Perhaps maybe once we all return from Florida, it might be best that I find somewhere else to live. Unless, of course, you can find it in your heart to... <sighs> Forgive me. I hear there are a lot of nice efficiencies in Cloverton. If you don't mind getting scabies. I don't, actually. But perhaps maybe you could give me... Mm -hmm. Oh, it's probably another time good. Let's not get paranoid. It's a woman. <laughs> The fuck? That's Isabel Feathers. Hey. What? The talentless wannabe who portrayed me in the Cloverton Theater's Our Town. Huh? Oh. What's she doing in the time stream? Uh, that might be my bad. It fell way into my time hole. I, I didn't think it was worth mentioning it. Please, angry Jesus! The woman who hit the time machine caused them to go to the future. Vienna sausages and skittles. Ew. On both fronts. No, wait. Oh, you fucking asshole. Right. Oh, Why did you do that? <sighs> okay, that's him again. Welcome to 2042. Holy shit, bears. Who is it? It's you, it's baby. You. Papers called it the butt apocalypse. <laughs> oh no. I think he's serious. We killed those assholes. Apparently we missed one. And infected it with zombieism. You mean to tell yep. us the world has been overtaken by zombie butts? You won't find anyone in your room. Oh. I can only mean one thing. Good. I am at a LARPing retreat. I'm dead then, aren't I? You moved out right before shit kicked off. I'm at a LARPing retreat. Look, I'm at the every day. <laughs> Fuck. Larry? They're dead. Everyone's dead. I see. Your perfect grandson, Rory. You never get to touch him. Oh boy. 
Oh, Hi. thank God. Look at you. You're all grown up. What is going on here? Oh. Oh. Uh oh. Is that okay? No. Oh, fuck. She's in hell. She, he's gonna steal the time machine. If you all keep them occupied, I'll double back and take Shipley. I may be in the minority, but perhaps we should give our past selves a chance. <laughs> Could you imagine? It's you! I was stealing the time machine instead of telling us how to stop this better. Look, you're just gonna fuck it up. If you know how to avoid this, then you need to tell me. There's no point. Where you're at right now, you're not gonna hear me. What about us? Are we in a clear headspace? You better be. Fight the future. Hell no! I'd rather be ravaged by zombie busting people at that point in my life. What? Then I'm not going either. It's broken. Damn, I fell all, all the way apart. You're not leaving anymore, are you? Given what we've seen in the future? Well, isn't this just the shitty cherry on top of a shitty Sunday made of shit? Okay. I will not touch a single thing with my new hand before I get to you. What the hell? This better be good, Bunbury. I was in the middle of Graham Norton. The prophecy only mentioned the butts. I mean, this is real, really, really real. We're all well and truly fucked. Uh huh. Immortus will rise. Immortus. I don't know that one. It's a great name, but I don't know who the hell that is. But it doesn't sound good. I was hoping for a split second. It was uh, was it Mr. Nobody from season one? Alan Tudyk. But it's just me being hopeful. Uh, yep, it's still Doom Patrol. It's still ridiculous in parts, but, you know, there's always a big bad, or at least this time a butt bad. Uh, just zombie butts. And they did the time machine thing and broke it. Got to see the future, how horrible it is. But, I mean, at this point, they know it starts in Cloverton. And... They've already destroyed that town like a million times and put it back together. You know, uh, we'll, we'll see because it's just the one. How do you find a zombie butt? <laughs> so they have to basically think completely outside the box because clearly whenever they've been doing as a team, which is basically just kind of slap dashing their way into victories, hasn't worked or, or will not work against whatever this is. It's, it's been working against like God peace. Just really don't, don't, don't rip off the cock rocket and Chota Boy from Orgasmo. How dare you? That is clearly Chota Boy. You know, if it was combined with, like, Jason Momoa. <laughs> By the way, if you don't know what Orgasmo is, go find it and watch it immediately. <laughs> it's so stupid. It's wonderfully stupid. Delightful. Yeah, thank you guys for watching. Comments. Let me know what you thought of the episode. We'll jump into number two next week. We'll be doing uh, Doom Patrol on Thursdays until we're caught up. I think the first part here is six episodes, so... Yeah, we'll, we'll bang them out in a month and a half and go from there. I don't know when part two comes out, but I got a, I think it's like summer or something. It's going to be a good little gap, so we'll be here for it, though. 
It's fun, delightfully stupid. <laughs> God, peace. What the hell? Yeah, thank you guys for watching. Appreciate you. We'll talk to you next time.